Hello and welcome everybody to our, well, it's the semi-final, the semi-final of Styling Forward and it's very, very exciting. And uh, we have two looks for you tonight, which I'm going to come to later, but... um, First of all, I'm going to go to our judges, and of course, we have the wonderful, the delightful, the fabulous Mimi Boa. Hello, Mimi. Yeah. Yeah. And we have as <laughs> we have as our guest judge this week one editorial clarity, who I'm sure you're all familiar with, a member of Bossel and Co. Executive and fabulous breakfast show on Bossel Radio. Hello, Eddie. Hello. And of course, our redoubtable, the inimitable. The wonderful, the mysterious, the extraordinary Frolic Mills. Hello, Hello darling. Frolic. I am having coffee. Yeah. Hello. I want to tell something. Yeah. Just me, me because the people said I harass sexually men, I think Eddie is very lovely in real life. Uh, he has a very <laughs> <few> real life. <laughs> <laughs> You're jumping straight for it. He's yep. very, very yummy. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he's close to you. He's in London. You can go and visit. I don't know. Yes, yes. Oh but I'm, um, I think I'm a little bit old for him, by the way. But, uh, you know, vintage is fabulous. <laughs> I think Eddie likes all the women. <laughs> Right. I'm, 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 I'm kidding, but he's very lovely. He's a, he has a very nice face, so <laughs> it's cute. Yeah, cross your legs, Eddie. She's on her way. Mm-hmm. It's a good have, start. You seen, yeah. have you seen Eddie's self, um, shameless self-promotion for the face of Malto? He, he, uh, he made these recordings in, in YouTube saying, please vote for me. Look at this face. I want to be the face of Malto. <laughs> Aren't I adorable? <laughs> look at me, look at me. And so he shows himself on the video, which is very funny to watch. It is yeah. indeed. And yeah. he's a very adorable person. And I think if anybody has missed it, you have to listen to uh, Bossel Breakfast Show with him and uh, La Bella Farella. The two of them are quite a team. Anyway, next I go to our sponsors of Styling Forward, and that's... By K Designs, My Animation, Avcom Productions, Stiletto Moody, Miss Virtual World Organization, Metaverse Television. And of course, there is all to play for. The prizes are 100,000 Lindens. 100,000 Lindens. Who couldn't do with that just before Christmas? The cover of Bossel Magazine. A contract with Boulevard Model Agency, which, you know, is probably worth more than another 100,000 Lindens. I don't know. I've never had a contract with Boulevard Model Agency for very obvious reasons. A Mayor Culpa goodie bag and, of course, the title of Master Stylist. So, what else can I say? So, who do we have first? I am just going to check round the back. Who is ready and who is first for us? And would they come on down, please? Oh, my God. Yeah, I think, so, I think the fir- one thing we yeah, can remember. Well, we of- start with the urban. Yes, we start yes. with urban. And the second one is sexy teacher. My goodness me. So, but we've got urban first. So just control yourselves, okay? Urban can be sexy enough. And the first person we've got is Leandra Breen. Woo! Come on down, Leandra Breen, please. Let's make a big round of applause for Leandra. We have, we have only three honeys today, so we have to make a mess. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a long walk down for our little urban miss, Leandra Breen. Oh, wow. Mm. I know. Okay. So... We are going to go first to our lady judge, Mimi Boa. What do okay, you think? Okay, the first, the first is Urban. It's okay? Yes, yes. Correct. Okay, because I thought the teacher said, oh my God, she's going to teach. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Urban style. Oh my God, I love this kind of mm-hmm. stockings. And you know, the, the funny thing is when we got this kind of mess in the stocking in real life, we are desperate and we take off the stocking even if uh, 
16 minus, by the way. But, <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, I love, as usual, the style of Leandra. She has a perfect uh, urban style, um, and she seems uh, a, a very, very evil and dangerous mm. woman of the ghetto. <laughs> <laughs> look at, at the air base, I love it. And look at the leather jacket, I got one the same in real life, full of mm. pins. <laughs> and it's fabulous, I love it. But, um, you know, we have three fabulous honeys today on the stage and it will be very difficult. By the way, Leandra, for me, you are amazing. Thank you very much, Mimi. Next, we go to our guest judge, Editorial Clarity, Eddie. I love it. Wow. I'm looking mainly. I love the face and the hair. The pattern on the back of the head is really cool. Definitely urban. The whole thing is urban. And the belt, too. She's done very good with the accessories and the shoes as well. She actually reminds me of someone. I'm trying to think who it is, but I watched a movie a long time ago. It was a Swedish movie, and Ooh. there was someone in there who looked a little bit like how she looks. But I think Leandra's done really well, and I've been watching her through the competition so far, and she's done... She's done really, really amazing, as they all have, obviously, the final three. So definitely going to be a tough one if this is the first one out. Really good. I like it. Thank you very much, Eddie. And going to Frolic now. Hi, Leandra. Leandra, I don't, I, I'm going to tell you something. I, I mean, when, when we talked urban, I suppose that if we, you know, take it all the way into the absolute goth, devilish, dark and gothic uh, get, you know urban ghetto then I suppose I would see someone like you but let me tell you urban is, is anything you know every any street of any city really is urban you know and if I ever walk on the streets of Caracas and meet somebody like you I would run I so crash fast it. I'm telling you oh oh Mimina crashed no, we'll wait Mimina. for you Mimi we'll wait for you don't worry Oh, my God, poor me. Anyway, Leandrita, I love the exercise. I think it's really beautiful. I think it's... Um, I wish... The only thing I can say is that I wish I would... Um, is that you would have made it a little more international, you know, like on any street. It didn't necessarily have to be, you know, this punk, gothic, rock thing that you have going on, but, you know, a friendlier type of thing. Because if I'm honest with you, you are... Scary and um, and I think you're borderline to gothic mama, you know, vampire thing. But anyway, I think the exercise is beautiful. I, I really love what you did. I just wish it was a little more, you know, real urban rather than, you know, this dark, evil bitch of the universe. <laughs> but anyways, I like it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Leandra Breen, dark evil bitch of the universe. No, Please she's simp she is simply a rockin'. She is a rockin' uh, urban street woman. Yeah, yeah. I'm very scared. Yeah. I'm scared. It's a bit punk rock. I have to so wait some scared. minute to relog. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> right, you've started a fight amongst the judges, Leandra. So I think <laughs> this afternoon is going to be really, really interesting. <laughs> Could you take your place at the back? Thank you so much. And next we have... There we go. Laura Lee Bailey. Uh, 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 yes. Hello. Because the alphabet speaks for itself. Oh, L oh yes. M. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Goodness me. I've just got to get her. That's the only thing. <sighs> To let me smoke. Let me then smoke. Then I have to announce it. Yeah, have a smoke. Have a coffee. Yeah. Have a no, sit smoke. Down. I'm taking smoke. it that you're back online now, Mimi. Yes, I'm coming. Okay. So, Lorelai Bailey, come on down. If I will be a puff of smoke, I will scream a bad very word in Italian. You're a very that word. Oh, let me, let me. Yes, I will scream a bad word in Italian if I am a Cosmo. It's the one you I promise. Find okay, here we are. Lorelai Bailey. Now, Mimi, you are first, my darling. No, I don't see anything. Okay, so. I'm rooted. You, I'm, you're I'm, still I'm rooted. just a proof of smoke. Cazzo. Oh. Okay, Eddie, would you like to come in? Is Lorelai rest for you? Yeah, yeah, okay. she's res. Um, let me see. Ah, I like it. 
it's 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 nice. It's I don't I've never seen an urban style like that. I don't think, but I do like it. I like the uh, the jewelry. I don't like the hair, but mainly the color of it. But that's just me. Looks a bit strange. Um, I like it. The hat. Yeah, it's not. It's kind of like. Uh, a little bit Cheryl Cole, if you know Cheryl Cole. Mm. She dresses a little bit like that with the jackets, the shoulder pads and things. I like And the hat. I like it. I think it looks nice. It looks good. Yep. Okay. And um, so, uh, Mimi, can you see now? No, I don't no, see nothing. anything. Okay. Frolic, would you like to come in now? Yeah, Mimi sure. Is Hello, Aurora. Hi, you little pretty little girl you. <laughs> Mimi, you know what? Um, I'm not Mimi. Lorelai, your face <laughs> looks so beautiful today and it's a shame you're wearing all of those ugly things on you because honestly, honey, it is the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. The hair, what the hell you were thinking? It looks like a fungi, algae color and it's the ugliest great green shade I have ever seen in my entire life. I have no idea what you were thinking. Uh, and the alpha just doesn't go. It, I don't know. Um, I don't know if you're urban or, you know, some weird soldier who escaped. And I don't know. I don't like it. And the hair is clashing against the jacket. I'm sorry, Lorelai. I absolutely hate it. Yeah, you're, that's the inspiration, Mary J. Blige. Um, yeah, even Mary J., um, would not be caught in that, honey. I'm so sorry. I do not like that. Yeah. Okay. You know. Let's see, Mimi. You're okay. Have you okay. Read I. It? Yes. I read. I read. Well, I'm not that um, uh, catastrophic, <laughs> yes. <laughs> but okay. Um, there are some pieces I like. I think there are some little mistakes with the color. Um, there are a lot of silver and gold together that I I don't like a lot, but uh, okay. Um, this is maybe a little bit more a Lady Gaga style than Harban, to be honest. But okay, do you know I love you and I think you are absolutely amazing and cute. So uh, I can say you are. Uh, <laughs> and look at her face, Mimi. Her face is beautiful, and I'm like, oh my god, I wish she was not wearing that. She's pouring. She's pouring to me. She's pouring yeah. to me. Yes. Pouring, pouring, like purpur. -pour. Okay, Laura, like you get a purpur -pour from all of us. There you go. Okay. Okay, baby. Uh, pour, not that pour, catastrophe. Oh, pouring. Me, right. There you it's go. Okay. Yeah. There, are, there are some little mistakes, but it, it's, not, it's not that bad, baby. Honey, and I pour little, for you. Huge. Excuse me. Right. More fights amongst the judges, Lorelei. So, <laughs> would you like to take your place back, Leandra, please? Okay. So, next we have Melanie Sotoro. And... Uh, so, Melanie, please, come on down. But then, don't forget, we have two. Um, oh, yes, two. we've got... Yes, we do. Yes. We're going to have an interval and between maybe, them. And, and maybe uh, between a while, it's better we send the girl... No, we're going to keep them here, and then we're going to... So you can have a last look at them before they go, and then they'll okay. go backstage whilst we talk amongst ourselves. And then no, I think I've maybe we should sing. Maybe we should sing. <gasps> Yeah, get Mimi to sing. Oh She's being... it's, too, it's too late now. My, uh, oh. my neighbors will kill me. Oh, yeah. This is what you said last time. So we'll just have to move the time till earlier. Okay, Melanie, thank you. So let's go first to Mimi. Hey, baby. Where are you going to go? <laughs> you danger. My God. Dress, you will be very dangerous and yummy. Trust me. <laughs> yes, that's uh, lovely, Mel. I like uh, the jacket. Let me let me come on the jacket. The back, I think this. 